find anything? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. It might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. Well, good. You seem like an okay guy. And the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of. Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Ah, oh. super. Let's get that one a bit closer. The pants came in here hoping to survive. Okay, it looks like we're gonna lose him. Let's move on. Check on his health. Nic co by mě mohlo dovést k něčemu dalšímu. Dad kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Head back into the drugstore with me. Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I... Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? Was. Takže začínáme. Respektive pokračuju tam, kde jsem skončil. Takže jsem tady v šoku a musím si získat prášky pro nemocného těla. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Uh, okay. Come on. Let's have a look around. Okay. Ah, zombies. Good. I can't reach that brick. Ah. Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the cowboy, right? No. Jump up? 
Did anyone ever have? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. I've got to knock that lock over there. I imagine going out the back door and around is out of the question. If we're gonna help Larry, we need to get this lock off of there. Let's head back inside. Okay. Hey, Tommy. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. <laughs> you guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine, let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Myself, even if I had a weapon. We're going to need weapons. Let's head back to that wall. Safe there. Well 
There's a truck over there. Maybe we can find you a weapon.